Hey folks, Andy with you for App Central. Once again, today we're taking a look at Pocket Booth. It is a film strip app. And I got this a few months ago and I did a fair bit of research because I wanted to find a, a good one that worked well, did what I wanted and had lots of good reviews and various other things that led me to this one. And I've been really happy with it. So I haven't checked out any other since. So this is my choice. So uh, at the end of uh, this video feel free to uh, you know make suggestions on any others that you think are possibly better because I haven't uh, checked out in the last few months so as always uh, I have for you a uh, link down underneath if you like the looks of this uh, you can check it out there with a quick link all right no more fussing around I'm just going to show you there is a whole bunch of settings and a bunch of different effects that we have within uh, this little app and this one is antique. Just want to give you a feel for, for the onboard stuff there. And I just turned around, there happened to be my guitars there, so I figured they would be a good subject. That's your straight color mode. The next one is black and white. And I'm going to show you, you can have a choice in how many photos you want in your strip. So four is a good number. Uh, obviously, when you export, you don't want the thing to be uh, too stupidly long if you're uploading to Facebook or something. Uh, this one I really dig. It's kind of got a green effect. I think it's called 70s. A real greeny sort of vibe, which I like the saturation in that. And there we go. There's uh, they're the different filters. So let's have a look at the settings that we've got here. Uh, very intuitive, very, very clear. So you can decide how many you want, how many photos you want in your strip there, uh, what effect that you want, which is what I was just showing you then. Uh, you can have glossy or matte photo paper stock, which is really cool. Uh, border color, time between shoots, which is really, really handy. Um, auto save, uh, you have the option of having a flash there as well and which way you want the, uh, the camera to face. So everything that you'd expect and you also have the option here of exporting all the uh, film strips that you've done so far, which is really nice. Uh, other apps don't normally do that, you have to do things one by one. So it's really cool, it's a really great app. I haven't bothered looking for anything since because um, I've enjoyed it so much. Uh, really good interface, very intuitive. So the link is down below. If you're looking for a film strip app, uh, this one has suited my needs very nicely, and I think it will for you as well. Leave a comment if you have any suggestions on an app that you prefer over this one. And be sure to like uh, the video as well if you've enjoyed it, and subscribe for more iOS camera apps. This channel is all about uh, photography and music apps are dedicated to that stuff. All right, guys, catch you for another review, demo, <laughs> and all that sort of good stuff soon.